Hi everyone, welcome to another video. We are now in week 3 of our circuit breaker and it is extending into another 4 weeks till 1st of June. Things are supposedly settling down but now we need to adjust ourselves again. And I wish everybody to stay calm and we stay united and stay safe so that we can go through these challenges together. So now, from the previous video, I had some negative feedback about using the Zoom app. And I can totally understand why people can be skeptical for using Zoom. The main reason why most people are concerned is because of the recent security breaches and the rise of the hackers joining in on calls. Therefore, some companies or even school have some minor trust issue towards this app, which totally understandable. Uh, by the way, uh, I am not sponsored by, not sponsored by Zoom. Uh, so I'm not telling you to use it. Don't get me wrong. Zoom is just my personal preference because for average Joe like me, uh, I, I feel that it's sim simple and easy to use. This video is more about how we can use video calls to retain some of our normal life. Personally, I feel Zoom is one of the easiest to use in terms of video chatting and the fact that I can host many people at the same time is very useful. Many people tell me that Zoom might be collecting information from us and with that, I have to say, <laughs> we weren't able to confirm or deny. However, the same people who tell me not to use Zoom uh, use Facebook to call each other even though it has been confirmed that Facebook collects and records your data. So the moral of this story is, whenever you are on the internet, we will always be subjected to risk. All we can do is to minimize the risk by taking necessary privacy and the safety precaution. I put a video on how to secure your Zoom meetings links below. So if you want to learn more, you can click from there. By the way, besides conducting uh, various online seminars, my company also met up in Zoom for the Sing Together on last Saturday. It was very rewarding to connect with so many people and sing in harmony. Furthermore, I am still receiving viewing inquiries from buyers who are looking for a home. Many people would be surprised that people are still buying property. But uh, like I said before, a home is essential. There will always be people searching for a home, which is why I'm doing video, sorry, I'm doing viewings via Zoom. Instead of waiting to view the house after 1st of June, giving my buyers a virtual tour beforehand so that they can view the house safely and we won't know if circuit breaker will be extended again or not, because it really depends on the COVID-19 situation. So besides staying at home, actually my business as usual, and it has been busier than ever. Instead of physically go for training, uh, meeting up or viewing the house with customer physically, we do it via Zoom. Initially, I was uncomfortable using it as well. But after a few uh, Zoom meetings with my clients, I find that it's actually quite simple to use. And it is a great tool to catch up with your clients or friends remotely, to chit chat or sharing ideas with PowerPoint slides and discussion with pictures or even videos. It's really helpful to get us connected with one another. And I believe this may be the new norm in future, even after this COVID-19. Because nowadays people are always too busy to have time to meet up with each other. So we might just be doing the meet up via Zoom instead. So besides doing, using it for work purposes, uh, you can use it to connect with your loved one and your family members who are not staying together with you and to support each other during this time instead of just calling or WhatsApp. So just give it a try. You will discover it's that simple and I have a tutorial on how to use this app on my previous video. I will put the link here and you can click on it to learn about the app. So use it as for your own convenience. 
And this comes to the end of my video. Please give a thumbs up if you like this video and share it to anyone who you feel that it is useful to them. And comment below if you like to share your thoughts. I will greatly appreciate. And I will see you in the next video. As always, stay home, stay safe.